Greetings and salutations, everyone. Jake Vegas here with Jake Vegas Digital, and today we're going to talk about fishing. More accurately, we're going to talk about fishing games, the current state of fishing games in the gaming world, and what we can expect in the future. So first off, let's discuss a subscriber favorite, Fishing Planet. As many of my subscribers are aware, I'm holding off on creating any more Fishing Planet videos until the new waterways are released. According to the Fishing Planet developers news feed, five new waterways and 20 plus new fish species will be introduced into the game. The waterways will be located across Europe, including the Czech Republic, the Netherlands, Italy, Russia, and Great Britain. I won't go through all of the 20 plus new fish species, but I will say they include European favorites like tench, chub, and grass carp. Also coming in the future are the abilities to use multiple rods at once and feeder fishing. When this new content will be released, the fishing planet is still to be determined, but the developers have given a vague time frame of a few months. Personally, I'm hoping this new content will come to the game sooner rather than later. Another free-to-play fishing game that recently became available on Steam is Russian Fishing 4. Now I've dedicated some time to RF4, as it's more commonly known. With over 110 hours in the game, I've become familiar with its mechanics and the overall feel of it. One question I am asked is if I think Russian Fishing 4 is better than Fishing Planet. And it's very difficult to answer that question. Russian Fishing 4 is brutally realistic in comparison to Fishing Planet. In RF4, you may be at a particular spot at a particular time of day and have excellent luck catching fish there. But the very next day, you could be at that very same spot at that very same time and not get a single bite. To my understanding, the fish in RF4 migrate around the lakes and rivers, so they won't be at the same spots each and every time. There are also role-playing mechanics in RF4 where you assign points to different skill sets in order to develop those skills more deeply and factors like stamina, hunger, and comfortability come into play as well, affecting your ability to catch fish. So to answer the question, do I think Russian Fishing 4 is better than Fishing Planet? I say to judge that for yourself. RF4 is free to play and available to download from Steam, so you can try to formulate your own opinions at no cost. The third fishing game I'd like to discuss is Ultimate Fishing Simulator, which is currently in early access on Steam and is available at the price of $19.99. Now I did have beta access to Ultimate Fishing Simulator and I honestly was not impressed at that time when I tried it. I found the graphics to be bland in the beta and I didn't like the feel of fighting a fish. It was very mechanical and it just didn't seem all that fun. I also felt the fish models themselves were dull and their appearance didn't always correlate properly to the actual size of the fish. But keep in mind this is my experience from the beta testing. Ultimate Fishing Simulator could have improved light years since that time. Currently this game offers spin fishing, float fishing, theater fishing, and ice fishing along with sea fishing. Now sea fishing has been a feature I've seen requested across the fishing game spectrum and few have incorporated it into their games, but apparently Ultimate Fishing Simulator has it. I can neither recommend or condemn Ultimate Fishing Simulator since I haven't played it since its beta phases, but I wanted to bring it to the attention for you fishing gamers who are looking for more options out there when it comes to fishing games. Now the fourth fishing game I'd like to discuss is Pro Fishing 2018, which hasn't been released yet, but is scheduled to be released the third quarter of 2018, which should be relatively soon. With that said, I can't comment much on this game other than to reiterate what the developers have already stated about it. The developers of Pro Fishing 2018 say the game offers huge maps with many fisheries, along with an ATV to get around to your favorite fisheries. Many fish species are said to be available, and the developers say that there will be an extensive multiplayer system including tournaments and fishing clubs. Finally, and probably the most important part for many of us, Pro Fishing 2018 will be free to play on Steam. Of course, that means that there will probably be microtransactions involved, 
but at least we'll get to try the game to see if we want to invest any of our hard-earned dollars into it. I can say that I'm looking forward to the release of Pro Fishing 2018 to see what it brings to the fishing game genre. The last fishing game I'd like to discuss and the one I'm actually the most excited for is Fishing Sim World. Fishing Sim World is being developed by Dovetail Games and is scheduled to be released on September 18th, 2018 on Steam and I believe it's also going to get an Xbox and PlayStation release as well. Unfortunately, Fishing Sim World will not be free to play and it does have a moderate price tag of $39.99 or $44.99 if you want the deluxe edition. There will be bass fishing, pike fishing, carp fishing, just to name a few of the 18 fish species that will be available in the game. Fishing Sim World will also feature boats, dynamic weather, as well as tournament and multiplayer, and the developers say the game is fully licensed by some of the biggest companies in the fishing industry. What impresses me most about this game is the graphics and the look of the game as presented in its trailer. I intend on investing in Fishing Sim World, and I hope I'm not disappointed by the actual gameplay when it's released, but I'll be sure to let y'all know my thoughts regarding Fishing Sim World when I get the chance to play it. Now that'll conclude this 2018 breakdown of fishing games currently and soon to be available to us. Looks like there's a lot for us virtual anglers to be excited about in the near future. If you enjoyed this video, shoot that like button and be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to stay up to date on future content. I'm Jake Vegas with Jake Vegas Digital. Thanks for watching. Keep on fishing in the free world, and we will see you next time.